morning and welcome to Over Easy Acres. As you can see, we're at the park this morning because it's still nice and cool. It's about 75, not too hot of a day ahead, maybe about 95. But while we're busy playing here, I'm gonna show you what I was up to this morning to get dinner prepped. We have kind of a busier evening because we're gonna go out to our property and get the chickens rounded up for their appointments, their freezer camp in the morning. Um, that comes awfully quick. It's a 5.45 a.m. appointment. So we're gonna have a little bit of an early dinner and then head out to the property and I'll show you that as we do it. I love not having to do dinner at dinner time. I love dinner, but I don't like cooking it when um, I'm everybody's tired and busy from the day. So I got that all kind of out of the way and then it's just a matter of assemble later on and then we're good to go. So I'll show you that and then I'll meet you back here. We're all done here, heading back home. What do you think? It's delicious. <laughs> so we put the ranch on the side just so it wasn't too uh, seasoned. Do you think it needs some ranch or what do you um, think? I don't know. I haven't tried it yet, but with the ranch, but I think it will be good either way. <laughs> okay. I just went back inside to grab my glasses. Note on my head. Okay, we're off to the farm. This is the last night for the birds. We've got to bring them back to our house because the appointment is so early in the morning. I feel bad for you, honey. Yep, <laughs> I won't remember a thing. <laughs> so I wanted to go with them, except that because Tacy doesn't quite sleep through the night and she sleeps with us in bed, I'm afraid of her waking up in the morning and wondering where we are, even though the girls would be home. I just. Um, that's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be totally there for you, honey. I am your biggest fan. <laughs> okay, and for such a special occasion, well, a special occasion for us, I did bring some chocolate because nice. we just had our dinner. So um, we'll have a little dessert on the road and then I'll show you what we're up to when we get there. Do you have hair all over your face, Casey? Yeah. <laughs> Why is that? Is it Dottie? She's putting her head out the window. Come out. Okay. 
are they doing? Ooh. Okay, didn't like the dog. They've uh, messed up the watering truck. So. Yeah. All right, guys and dolls. Here we go. Okay, so for the plan tonight is we're going to put the chickens in the dog crate here and we're hoping that they'll all fit and then they'll just come back to our house tonight and we just wait for their appointment in the morning. So we're just going to start to load them up. It's pretty warm out here. I don't know, about 93 I think my phone said. No, 91? 93? I don't remember. But there is a little soft breeze so that's pretty nice actually. That's not bad. A bit of a problem. Our birds are huge and we don't have enough space to carry them. All right, thank goodness for neighbors. Our neighbor has an extra crate that we're going to go over and borrow and he actually uses it for this exact purpose. So, this is great. Take it! are all loaded up. Whoop, it's very bumpy. Um, we'll go home, sleep fast, and see you in the morning. Good morning, birds. He took the birds and now we're gonna go pick them up. We're almost there. It's nice this place because they freeze them for you. Didn't they come back frozen last time? I think it's nice. They age them for a day and then they freeze them so you can just straight stick them right into the freezer. It's really handy. All right, go see if I need to pay here. Okay, it was 138.90 for our 21 birds. Okay, she's just gonna open that door and then we'll load them up.
huge. Oh my god. Heavy. Let's go. I think one of these doesn't quite fit though. I don't know, just stick it in and I'll figure it out. That's a snack. It's a McNugget. That'll fall out. But... It's okay, just stick it in there and I'll figure it out. Thank you. All right, well, we're back home from the chicken project of 2023. Uh, we do have a thought of maybe running one more batch before frost sets in. I don't know, this is kind of a hard time to decide after you've just done it, if you really want to do it again. So, but it is really nice to have a freezer full of meat. Just feel secure with that. So anyway, I'm going to feed my little layers here some eggshells. They seem to know that they're going to get a treat and then I will finish up this vlog. We'll see you in the next one. So make sure that you subscribe and share and hit the notification button and then you won't miss what we're up to in the next one. Bye friends. Mm -hmm.